Paradox and how cool is it to build and fly your own RC airplanes? It's awesome. And we fly electric airplanes with LiPo batteries. One of my favorite motors is the Wellguard 20 to 1210. That is a 1400 kV motor that spins an 8x3 APC prop. Now if you have an 8 inch prop, that's a pretty big prop. We've got a lot of planes that that size of prop doesn't work on because it'll smash the ground and we'll slice them off every time. We also use a 2200 kV Wellguard motor. This motor spins 6x4 prop. Both of these motors are branded by Grayson Hobby, and you can get them both at graysonhobby.com. And we really like twin tractor setups. So we have twin micro jets in quite a few airplanes. Here we have two micro jets in our park zone airframe. And this worked really good for this plane. This plane will just go pure vertical out of sight. Here's another plane where I got the twin micro jets on. This is our first ever wild talk. And our first real RC plane besides air hogs. This is Wild Hawk Dad. And we've got the twin micro jets on this plane up front. This is just the perfect, perfect setup. These micro jets just fly this plane beautifully. It's really good because they have small props because they're really close to the center. So here's a perfect place to put twin micro jets on your wild hog. We just love flying. Here's another unusual place to find these micro jets. Here we have it, our Banana Hobby Blitz RC A10 Thunderbolt. This plane is beat up, but the motors really work on it. <laughs> Crashed into a pole, got its wing torn off, it lived. to brace the wing up. We beat this plane up so much that these babies didn't have enough power to power it. So we had to put extra control services on to balance the plane. Because of that, we need the extra power and we use micro jets. It worked pretty good, it's amazing. These guys have enough power to lift this and it's really, it's really heavy. We fly the twin 64 ducted fans with a 2200 mass 3 cell lipo. We powered the two micro jets with a 1300 Ma 3 cell light. So, this is just a crazy fun airplane set up like this. In this A10, it opens up, and here there's a plenty of room for two batteries. So this is like an army plane, it's a really awesome setup. This is our Eurofighter. You can't even recognize it as the Eurofighter. It's got a nose like a mosquito. The wings are all taped up. Bottom, pretty bad. So in this case, we actually just took out the ducted fan. And my little brother 
brother has been powering his little trucks with it. And we've replaced seductive fans with twin micro jets. It's a small plane that we have our micro jets on, but it actually works and it's awesome. So this is just another example of how you can keep a lot of planes flying with just micro jets. Here's another example of our twin micro jets. This is our super cool J20 that we built. This flies really good, you can do it high power, this has really high alpha, and it works great. The new flash plane with 2,000 or 1,300 baht batteries. The Chinese released this about two years ago. And you still can't buy a model of the J20. We're looking to buy one, but we can't get one. The one that we build here is really cool, the one we really love flying. and the micro discs make it possible. This is our 2.6 meter cell to cell plane. And we have two Grayson Hobby motors that power this plane. We power this plane with two 2200 mod three cell lipos. And these twin micro jets work really good in this plane. As you can see, we really use the twin micro jets. And these motors work so good for us. Go out and use your Grace and Hobby micro jets and have fun flying with them. Go fly off in Mercy Dock! Master Yoda! <laughs>